Wevan FC TV with Adam Hinchwood, head of Slough, uh, Slough Town away in the FA Cup, uh, second qualifying round. Adam, your thoughts on the cup draw and uh, on the game? No, yeah, obviously a tricky, tricky uh, tie for us. Um, hoping for someone at home, I think everyone is. But um, yeah, it's, it is what it is. Um, you know, it's a, it's a great test, another um, chance to look at another national south team, um, so which is good, and, and go to another good ground, got a nice new pitch, nice new ground, so yeah, it'd be a great, great experience for us and uh, one we look forward to. Speaking of the pitch, it's another team with a 3G turf, which I don't think we've come across so far in the, in the league this season, is that a bit of an advantage for you going into this one? Um, yeah, it can be, yeah, I think all the pitches that we've played on so far, uh, even away, um, well in... Weymouth uh, have all been very good really, so there's been no sort of complaints on, on that front. I think it's uh, one of the benefits maybe of uh, of the level that we're at now, um, you know, better surfaces for us to play on. So, yeah, it's uh, obviously um, great to, to, to get a nice 3G surface again and, yeah, it's, I don't think there'll be any benefits. They'll obviously train on it and, and, and be used to it as well. So, yeah, hoping for, for, for us to perform well in that. They've been in good form so far, Slough, obviously say it's another team in our league. Uh, they've won four of the last five, ninth in the table at the moment. Um, how would you feel about them? Do you think they're going to be quite tough? Um, what are you expecting from them? No, yeah, I think um, like every game we've played against the National sea South side so far, it's, it has been tough. Um, and, you know, I'm expecting that to be no different. Um, but, yeah, we don't sort of get too bogged down with what we're coming up against and just try and focus on, on ourselves and what we can do better. And, um, you know, I think there's there's plenty for us to improve on from the other night. Speaking of uh, looking at ourselves, uh, the performance from uh, Tuesday night, was that more or less what you expected? Are you looking to progress that into, into Saturday? No, there's definitely, um, you know, elements of it that was really pleasing. Um, you know, I thought we was making more forward passes and, um, you know, that sort of side of it was good. I thought we got the ball into the final third very, very often, um, so which is, which is really pleasing, which we want. Um, but yeah, when we're in there, we've got to make the most of the chances that we get and um, you know, it's definitely going to be uh, a challenge and, and something that we've got to look to do um, for Saturday. And also speaking of the squad, uh, is there any injury updates or any team news that... Um availability for Saturday? No, just obviously uh, Javon and Conrad uh, cup tied for Saturday, um, so a bit of a blow um, to not have them with us, but um, yeah, um, other than that, you know, clean sort of bill of health apart from apart from Jake, there's no no added knocks and stuff. Uh, Joel's been nice and a bit of a groin problem, but he's been getting through okay, so he'll be one to maybe look at, see if we... Um, potentially resting this weekend but you know we'll, we'll look at how he gets on tonight and uh, speak to him and, and see where we are. And uh, another player who potentially could be unavailable, uh, Luke Robinson, uh, could you just give us an update on his situation? Oh yeah he's literally just come back from injury, uh, such a shame we, we had a game for him against Lance and he ended up rolling his ankle in it and it's quite a nasty one I think, it's been about six weeks sort of getting back over that so that was in pre-season. So he's now got back and now it's just a case of getting him some minutes and um, getting him some game time and obviously you know Robbie and uh, Jamie really well at Bognor and uh, they were looking for a wide player, it just seemed like a good fit. Um, so yeah, he's going to go there for um, however long he needs really to get to get up to speed and get some game time and um, you know that'd be really important for him. Yeah, um, obviously a lot of options on that flank as well. With Luke, it'd be good for him to, to get some game time, as you say. Um, so just looking at uh, this weekend, obviously it's the FA Cup, back in cup action. How do you feel about the FA Cup this season and what are your ambitions for it? Well, yeah, I think um, it's one competition we sort of disappointed in, in in recent years. So, you know, definitely won't be through a lack of effort and determination that we try and win the tie. Um, like I say, we might have to rest one or two, but there's not going to be any sort of wholesale changes. Um, you know, we want to want to go there um, with a good squad and, and give a good account of myself. Um, I think that's really important. We do that. Um, like I say, yeah, aspirations. We want to go as far as we can. And um, good thing about being at this level as well. There's less games to win to get to the first round proper. Um, you know, so I'm sure you know us, Slough, and all the other sort of teams still in the heart have that dream. And um, yeah, we want to make sure we give a good good account of ourselves on Saturday.
Well, hopefully that dream does come true. Adam, thanks for your time. Cheers, thank you.